Hello and welcome to the Battlefield Top Plays. Starting off today, we have some incredible clips sent in from Jesus. This first one is a Battlefield 5 stunt on Mercury. You get to see how nice the map looks from up here, but also he gets that epic shot on the plane. Moving on, a couple of Panzerfaust again from Jesus. This guy seems to be probably the best player on Battlefield 5 at taking out planes with Panzerfaust. His accuracy and prediction is just incredible, picking up back-to-back -back shots on planes moving at speed. A couple more clips from him that are both equally as spectacular. Now moving on to three clips from Bercy. Starting off, we're going to be on Rotterdam with an aggressive push with the revolver Mark VI. Very strong accuracy with headshot after headshot, even the throwing knife was a headshot with two final kills with the sniper rifle. So accurate, one of the best sniping clips I've seen in recent memory. Moving on, again, Bercy showing off why he's one of the best snipers in the game. Not only does he get these great positions for flanking manoeuvres, but he makes it count with the headshots. And finally, we're looking at Twisted Steel for another accurate sniping clip. One of the most lucky clips I've seen in Battlefield, Jenkins throws a piece of dynamite and manages to take out an unlucky pilot who was flying across. I don't think he really worked out what happened until a few seconds after the clip. Either way, pretty awesome stuff. This episode of the Battlefield Top Plays is sponsored by Instant Gaming. You can check out the link in the description down below for cheap games. Use my affiliate link. It'll also help out the channel at the same time. There are some great deals to be had there at the minute, and it's a great place to buy a friend a game if you're looking to get them online with you. Next up is Ice 6, and we're looking at Aras. Not exactly your usual clip, and you'll see why in just a second. Visomi Viking sent in two streaks. The first is going to be on Panzerstorm, an accurate clip with the Krag Jorgensen. The second clip he sent in is with the ZK383, playing on Mercury on a game of conquest. He's pulling off quite a few kills on this Charlie objective. A lot of players are surrounding it, both friendlies and enemies, and he makes sure the flag gets cleaned completely, racking up a big point stack. Moving on, a clip on Battlefield 1 from Max. This is pure assault gameplay with the dynamite setting off a few kills making his way down into this section of the map on Monte Grappa he gets some serious kills with the SMG 08 Next up we have the Broken Machine. He's not often featured on this show because the guy's so busy he doesn't send clips in, but damn he is good enough to. And this was actually at EA Play where he managed to get himself a little clip on Marita, the new map that will be coming to Battlefield 5 fairly soon. A really awesome infantry map and a very satisfying clip. The Broken Machine has oh, it all. Where is it, buddy? Oh, don't do that. 
Oh, we have a sweet. Oh, hello. Where is he? <laughs> oh, another one. What the frick is going on over here? There's another guy on the floor. What the hell? And another one. Why is. <laughs> Why is going on? Get out. <laughs> Kyle Overman is going to be taking out two planes that are chasing after his teammate. Saves him in the nick of time before he gets taken down. Got him! I don't think you're going to make it. I don't think you're going to make it. I don't think you're going to make it. No, I got the other one! Oh, thank God. Kelpat 1089 is going to be pulling off a sniping clip on Hamada. This is back to back headshots in a very clean kill feed. Christian Veng Olsen is next up, Battlefield 1, and in a recent episode of the Top Players, we saw one tank shell take down two planes. And we're going to see the same thing in BF1, but not quite as spectacular as the planes unfortunately get stuck together. But he takes them both down with a blind third person shot. Either way, a very satisfying clip. Next up, it's the rush shot, and a battlefield top plays regular. This sniping streak is one that we've seen before, or at least it looks very similar. I know for a fact it hasn't been featured, but you know what I mean. Narvik pushing around the side of Bravo, shooting players in the back of the head. It's always going to be a clip that we see on this map, because players just sometimes never check behind them, and it makes it easy for a sniper to get in a flanking position like this and rack up some kills. Oh! Here we go, dude. Nice. Good stuff. The next clip he sent in is on Mercury, and this is far more satisfying pushing towards Delta Objective on a game of Outpost. Smokes his flank, still gets shot, manages to take out the threats, and then gets a big multiple kill spray down. Nice, dude. That was good. Moving on, it's Young Warrior. And this is going to be a satisfying sniping clip as he manages to get himself a couple of kills and then a little surprise at the end. Abby Yao is next. This is Rotterdam with a streak with a Suomi pushing underneath the Alpha objective in a game of operations. You often get big clumps of enemies down here, but it can be difficult to push in. The enemies don't check though. There's only a couple of them that realize they're being flanked. The smokes go down a couple of kills to start things off and then a whole load of kills with the hip fire spray down. Mr. Sarge 2121 is next with a very long range tank shot. He actually manages to get two in this clip with some long range sniping on Panzerstorm. Moving on, it's Joe Mama 123 with the PO8 carbine on a game of Outpost. And this is why Outpost can be very fun for some people. You get lots of enemies crowding around. He takes out quite a few with that PO8 carbine to start the clip off. And then you just saw it. He dropped the V1 down or the JB2, I suppose, as he's on the allied side. Look at this thing flying in. This is why Outpost can be a complete cluster at times. 
racking up a load of kills on top of that initial streak. Lego Racer 111 is playing on Bravo and this is an anti-tank clip. Starting out with that kill on an enemy piece of armor, he moves across Bravo objective and takes out a few more. The M1922 MG can be a complete beast and Drexido shows exactly why on Mercury with this multiple kill spray down. Big JB's next up, and this is going to be a RAS and a very satisfying revolver clip. Lots of kills on enemies that are confused how their teammates are dying. Lots of them get revived, and he just continuously farms them all up with the revolver and his throwing knives. Thanks for watching this episode of the Battlefield Top Plays. If you did enjoy, leave a like down below. Let me know your favorite clip in the comments and check out the players' channels in the description, and I'll catch you in the next video.